So one of the things that we introduced back in 24.10, now in 24.12, is the capabilities of third-party companies being able to create panels right so inside a media composer to facilitate a much easier workflow between different types of aspects. So I'll just give you a quick example of one right here. This one is actually called Quickshare, third-party company. What's cool about this is this is actually a scene that's been shot, but as you can see, that we have the clappers in it and so forth like that. What I can do with Quickshare is they'll actually take the audio file, they'll transcribe it, it'll give me a summarization, it'll give me transcription of it, but more importantly, because this is scripted, I can also go in here and say, you know what, this is an hour and four minutes long. I can say, you know what, take the crew out of there, take Sawyer out of there, and now it's actually really only 17 minutes of media that I can actually use. They also give you the capabilities of taking the script and pasting it in there and doing an auto edit. So after I've auto edited it, as you can see, this is totally edited it automatically for me, all based off the script. It's a really cool uh, third party app. Another thing too, we have one, one from Flawless, gives you the capabilities of doing voiceovers and actually remapping the face. That product is super high quality as well as they also require the sign offs of all the actors, actresses and so forth and before anything's processed. From streaming, having live streams coming out for over the shoulder to being able to go in and have archiving built right inside of your media composer so I can literally grab content here using the Spectra panel and it'll actually archive that media off. Also giving me the capabilities of looking at content that's in the archive before I decide to bring it back. These are, one more actually to talk about is Marquis. Marquis actually gives you the capabilities of connecting to Sony C3, CI, or going into uh, Live View, for instance, and having media moved automatically onto the system, represented in a panel so I can drag it into my project or bin. These are the types of things that integrations that the panel SDK offers you. So if you're interested in developing for it, or if you're a company to have your own tools, and you want to do, use this panel SDK, please feel free to reach out to us, and we can hook you up with it. <laughs>